Hey guys, so today I'm coming to you from my bathroom because we're going to talk a little bit about shaving our legs. And also, as you can see on my legs, I have some strawberry spots. You can see um, where I need to shave. See the hair? So stay with me and we'll be right back to talk about that. Okay, so we are ready to get started. Um, the reality is, guys, that if you're like me, you have normally just shaved with a bar of soap. I mean, I've tried the conditioner trick. It just, it's really slimy and it, it gunks up your razor really bad. Um, shaving cream, oh my goodness, I hate that because it's like a bag of potato chips, and it's like my dry shampoo. It's like you get one little puff of shaving cream in the can, and I mean, you use it a couple of times, and it's gone. Now, I'm OCD, so I shave every day. Uh, winter, summer, fall, spring, it doesn't matter. I shave every day. Uh, so, yeah, of course, I like to just jump in the tub and use the bar soap. Now, when I was using mass production soap that you get at the big chain stores or grocer or wherever my skin stayed really dried out all the time but when i started making cold process soap i noticed a change in my legs um, and i it, it was a really a really good change so i just want to go over some of the things. Now this is a step I don't usually take, but a lot of people like to do it and I understand why. And it's really easy to make um, a scrub to go on your legs prior to shaving. And you can make it with uh, olive oil, sugar, a little lemon juice, anything that has any type of exfoliating quality. Um, you can make it, just apply it to the leg it gets any dead skin off and it makes the hair stand out a little bit better and it's uh, easier to shave that way. I don't do that. Occasionally I have. And it kind of leaves the leg a little smoother. So, and you can do that on your legs if you choose to do so. A lot of people do it. Moi is not one of those people, but I thought I would give it a go since we were doing this. So, yeah. To me, it's just convenient to be able to shave my legs with the same soap that I'm taking a bath with. So, for years I used um, regular soap. And today I'm going to try or I've already used cold process, but I'm just going to give you a little demonstration of shaving with a cold process handcrafted soap. Now, I get great results with this. However, I am right now producing a cold process soap for body and shaving, and it'll even be more smooth and more soft for your skin. So, I like to use a razor with at least three blades in it. The cheaper razors are the ones with just one blade. Those are the ones you're gonna get nicks and cuts with, and those are the ones that's gonna leave your skin more dry. So, I usually start with the top of my legs, the thigh, but for this video, I'm just gonna do the bottom here. And you can see how easily it glides with the cold process soap. Because with cold processed soap, we use things like coconut oil, olive oil, things that are just smooth and better for your skin. So, so you can see how my skin is still smooth and it feels really good. I'm not gonna shave my entire leg. Here, I'm just gonna go over it a little bit. My leg is smooth, soft to the touch. No nicks, no cuts, no drags, no drying. 
And then once I dry it, I wouldn't even need lotion if I did not want lotion. But I make lotion and I make it in my favorite scent, which is Love Spell. I call mine Love Potion. And then I add that on there for the extra conditioning. So, and I anticipate that the new formula that I'm working on for the body and the legs, and you can use it on the body and then just switch to the legs, will leave an even better feel after shaving. So, hopefully in the next video or two, I'll be making that and that will be available very soon. And I'm going to call it Lady Legs Body and Shave. And I hope you'll tune in for that. All right, guys. Thanks for joining me. Talk to you later. Bye.